Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This time, my friends and I went to Ishigaki Island in Okinawa. We arrived and tried to have lunch, but the restaurant we entered go to had a long waiting line, so we decided to head to Heia Kubo Beach. Isn't it amazing? I'm really amazed by the beauty of the ocean. For lunch, we ate Okinawa noodles at Akashi Shokudo. They had a traditional Okinawa dish called Soki, which is juiced pork, and it was incredibly delicious. We decided to visit a workshop where you could make the homemade chili oil. They will showcase the spices specific to Okinawa and Ishigaki Island, allowing us to create our own original chili oil plants. I love the northern level of spiciness, so I add plenty of stewed peppercorns to make my chili oil. This time we were staying at Villa El Cielo Ishigaki. We are incredibly grateful to have received an invitation to stay here. It's just us in this beautiful space. It feels incredibly luxurious. Spaces encapsulates beauty, a sense of freedom, and relaxation. It offers a range of amenities including sauna, speaker, and barbecue set, ensuring that we can have great time even if the weather isn't perfect. But the real happiness lies in being able to enjoy the stunning nature. Beyond the pathway from the garden with pool, there is a private beach where we can admire the sunset. Oh, it's so heavenly. I can't believe we're already having this much fun when summer has barely started. On second day, we first took a ferry to Taketomi Island. We joined Warrior Buffalo Tour and fully enjoyed the Okinawan vibes. Then we went cycling and headed to the beach. It was so hot, but just being near the water made us feel refreshed. In the afternoon, we hopped on the private cruise and went cruising. It felt like we had entire sea to ourselves. The feeling was so incredible. 
We head to Hamajima originally island they call it. I couldn't believe such a beautiful sea exists in Japan. We enjoy some snorkeling and see what expensive white coral leaves. That was amazing experience. I'm ready to become Ariel at any moment. At night, we went to Yakitu restaurant where we could enjoy delicious ashigaki beef. The Okinawan stars appetizer and skewers made from local ingredients were all incredibly tasty. I highly recommend it. After dinner, we went to a nearby bar and had a cute Mexican mood. It was cute, but the cocktails had puns to them. We fully enjoyed our summer girls' night out. On the final day, I took a short walk on the private beach of the villa in the morning. Take a yellow sip, cause I'm trying to have a better day Ain't gonna get delirious, so just sit here by the way Might take a bigger sip, starting to feel okay I think the party's getting serious, so all the other things can wait Never listen a warning We left this villa and went to a popular juice shop called Papaya nearby they serve fruit juice made from freshly squeezed fruits and fresh sugar cane instead of sugar. It was incredibly delicious. After that, we went to Araka Falls, which is one of the most powerful spots in Ishigaki Island. We went to Himari Shock though for lunch and had tea and flash coffee. I bought ice cream, hurry and hurry back to Tokyo. It was a special trip that made me love Okinawa even more. So thank you for watching to the end and see you to the next.